What's up guys I'm Sean welcome back to fix my home channel today I want to show you how to find the error code and reset the G washer all the G washer has a LED light like this washer uh, they are going to work uh, the same so this one you see the water stay there and in the middle they stop working so we're gonna find out the error code and how to reset it together let's get started all right this is all the LED light I was talking about so if the your G is like this so you can find out the problem so the way we're gonna start we're gonna unplug the uh, the G from the uh, outlet and wait for 30 seconds so give it time 30 seconds and then plug it back in and after you plug it back in wait for 30 seconds again so I'm gonna plug back in and I will wait for 30 seconds after 30 seconds we have to hold the play button and at the same time we have to roll that counterclockwise seven times one two three four five six seven seven time and we leave the uh, the both bottom at the same time and we're gonna see there so let me do that and I'll be back so all right I reset it and you see the all the LED light is uh, blinking at the same time so it means it's ready so to get the error code you have to turn that knob uh, to the uh, con uh, I'm sorry, clockwise one time so I'm gonna do that you see so it's, it's showing the solid uh, LED light on the spin and you have to push the play two times so I did one time let me okay now you see the soak and rain is blinking we have a six LED light as you see here uh, we're gonna count one two three four five six so soak is number three and raise number five you can find this display fault chart under your uh, washer so and you can open and see all the felt code is here so ours is gonna be number 10 I can go through the video and you can stop anytime you want so number 10 is pressure sensor the pressure sensor is bad so I have to go in here and see what's the number 10 is it so that's the number 7 I just going as slow anytime you want you can stop the video and see what is yours so for us is number 10 so it's mode shift feedback monitor so and in front of that is a description and in but again in front of that is showing the how you can fix it but uh, in this video I'm not gonna uh, show the repair action or description I just gonna show you how to see the problem also you can test a different uh, section of the washer so to know if that that section is work or no so to do that you have to uh, turn that knob uh, clockwise and as you see the LED is gonna come now it's rain spin and just push the play now wash just push the play mm, wash spin push the play you can you can see different area and test it if it's working or no So when you're done you want to go back to the normal so you just have to uh, hold that uh, play button for three seconds and it's gonna go back to normal 
So as you saw, everything was in behind the behind the washer. So I be opened that panel, and all the wiring was over there. The washer started working, but as you see in the bottom, after a while it get wet. So we have a problem, another problem in the bottom of the uh, washer. So I'm gonna make another video to show you how uh, to show you guys how to fix that. So make sure subscribe to the channel and push the bell notification so you don't miss the, uh, the all other video we're gonna put in the YouTube. So thank you for watching and have a great day.